Hello there! This is Amanda Wilkson of Amanda Wilkson Tarot. It is Tuesday, February the 15th, 2022. Welcome to my channel. I'd like to just thank all of my new subscribers. I do appreciate you watching my videos and I appreciate you subscribing. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. Glad to have you. If you are a long-term subscriber, I thank you for your continued support. If you have not already done so, could you please like, share, and subscribe? It really helps my channel out. How are you doing today, everybody? I hope you're doing well. Hope you're taking care of yourself and the people around you and vice versa. I hope you know you're beautiful, you're gorgeous, and you have that beautiful star shining right inside of you. This is a general reading. It will not resonate with everyone out there. Take what does and leave the rest. And there's no gender in tarot cut in the deck for the collective. I think I'm going to watch Midsummer spirit i've been wanting to watch it the justice libra energy first card out the nine of pentacles i'm single because i can pay my own bills pentacles are earth energy taurus virgo capricorn pentacles are coins money look at all the coins in the tree she is dressed in gold because money's gold reading a book bottle of wine glass of wine she is independent, self-sufficient, ground and balance, stable, business person, makes her own money, takes care of her money. Single because I can pay my own bills. What is crossing this? The Queen of Pentacles, the Queen of Money. Pentacles are Earth Energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Pentacles are coins, money. I like all the black cats. She got a gold dress, of course, and a green shawl. This person is independent, ground and balance, stable, self-sufficient, a business person, makes her own money, takes care of her money, the queen of money, consciously known, eight of wands, passionate communication flying through the air, wands are fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, the eight of wands, this is rapid, passionate communication, text messages, messages on Social media, messages on dating sites, unconscious, two of swords, swords are air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, two of swords, you're being indecisive, you need to make a decision, I don't know what this decision is, but you have to make a decision, recent past, queen of wands, queen of fire, queen of passion, Wands are fire energy. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Look at her gorgeous red dress. She's got a scepter, a crown, flowers. There's a dragon behind her. Black cat, of course. She is good looking, charismatic, fun to be with, sexy and exciting. The queen of passion. Near future. Three of cups. Let your friends help you. Cups are water energy. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Cups are all about love. See these three people? This is happiness, friendship, reunion. Three people getting together, having drinks, probably haven't seen each other for a while. Let your friends help you. Where do you find yourself? The High Priestess. The High Priestess. This is Divine Feminine, sitting in her throne, sitting in her power, knows her worth, like her black cat, candles, books. Black Cat, Crystal Ball, Tarot Cards, Runes. It's kind of a witchy energy. Um, she is intuitive. She's empathic. She knows how to figure people out. External influences. The Ten of Wands. Ten of Wands. Wands are fire energy. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. She has got ten brooms. She is walking up the hill. Her hat cat this is the end of a burdensome cycle you've been carrying a burden for way too long it is time to drop that burden down and move on to a passionate new beginning hopes and or fears queen of swords swords are air energy gemini libra aquarius Ooh. i've been cards have been flying all day i don't know why Swords are honest, clear communication. You need to bring the Queen of Swords honest, clear communication or she will use her sword and cut you right out of her life. 
She makes head over heart decisions. Although if you are honest and clear with the Queen of Swords, she will be very loving, very loyal. Lots of defined feminine energy. We had the Nine of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Wands, the High Priestess, Queen of Swords. Overall outcome, Four of Cups, Cups are Water Energy, Counter Pisces Scorpio. He is sad, he's indifferent, he's apathetic, he's looking at these three empty, empty cups. But Source Spirit Universe is always here with that cup of self-love. You need to love yourself before you can love someone else. And you need to love yourself before anybody can really love you. Love yourself first. <clears throat> the Justice Libra Energy. She's blindfolded. Justice is blind. She's got a, a law book. There are the Libra scales. I like the black and white cat. Um, you may be involved in some kind of a court case, divorce, child support. You're going to win. Libra energy. Also, sometimes you, um, sometimes you're, the justice talks about cutting something or someone out of your life. Two of cups. Soulmate energy. Cups are water energy. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Cups are all about love. This is true love, soulmates, divine counterparts. Nine of Swords. This has been throw up, showing up a lot today. This is talking about being all up in your head. This is sleepless nights, having dreams, thinking about what you could have, should have, would have done differently if you had the chance. Swords are air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Somebody's got you all up in your head dreaming. Six of Swords. Swords are air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Six of Swords. This talks about uh, moving out of choppy waters into calmer waters, leaving something painful behind, and moving on. Well, that makes sense with the Nine of Swords here. Four of Swords, healing. Healing. Swords are air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Four of Swords talks about taking some time to yourself. Healing. Taking some time to rest, relax, recuperate, rejuvenate. The independent single because I can pay my own bills, queen of money, passionate new communication, decision that needs to be made, queen of money, or queen of wands, queen of passion, let your friends help you, the high priestess, you figured something out, end of a burdensome cycle, queen of sword, the justice, soulmates, Moving from out of choppy waters into calmer waters and healing. Sad, apathetic, love yourself first, and some sleepless nights here. This may have something to do with this burdensome cycle. Moving on out of choppy waters into calmer waters. Oracle cards. Yang, Divine Feminine. By the book. I don't know what to say about that card. Chop wood. Working, working, making your money. Love card. New love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Honeymoon, enjoy the bliss of fall holiday time together and healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. Sing, uh, single business person, queen of money, passionate communication, the queen of passion, let your friends help you. <clears throat> End of a burdensome cycle. Moving on. Leaving the past behind. The High Priestess. The Queen of Swords. Cutting something out of your life. The Justice. Soulmates. 
healing. Let's do these first. Yang, buy the book, chop wood, new love, honeymoon, healing family issues. Got lots of divine feminine energy. Channel your inner divine feminine. Independent, self-sufficient. Let your friends help you. Figuring people out. Soulmates. All right. Have a great rest of your day. I will speak to you soon. This is Amanda Wilson of Amanda Wilson Tarot. Bye for now.